Hi guys and welcome to TechPaste. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the dev channel, which is the build 25163. This build improves the taskbar experience a whole lot more and of course brings other new features as well. In this video, as always, we're going to talk about what is new, what is fixed and more info about this new Windows 11 Insider preview build for the dev channel. Before doing anything, please don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechPaste channel because it helps me out a lot. Before starting the video, a quick message from our video sponsor. This video is sponsored by AppMySite.com. AppMySite.com is a very cool website that allows you to convert your website into an awesome Android or iOS app. AppMySite makes app development easy. You can build premium native mobile apps for both Android and iOS without writing a single line of code. The process of creating an Android app is really simple and you just need to select certain design elements and in the end connect your website with the platform. Finally, you will be able to download the app for your phone and use it. Visit appmysite.com for more details and create your app today. Let's continue with the video. First of all, in this build, we have the new taskbar overflow. This is again a feature that is not automatically enabled for every Windows Insider. So for example, I don't have it, but of course you're gonna have a screenshot on the screen to see how that new experience will look. So basically Microsoft is reintroducing the taskbar overflow with a newly designed experience for Windows 11. The taskbar should automatically transition into this new overflow state when it has hit its maximum capacity. In the state, taskbar will offer an entry point to an overflow menu that allows you to view all your overflowed apps in one space. The overflow menu will contain many of the current taskbar behaviors users are familiar with, such as supporting pinned apps, jump lists, and extended UI. After invoking overflow, the menu will quietly dismiss once you click outside of it or navigate to an application. I think this is a really nice idea by Microsoft, and of course, I'm gonna try to make a video as soon as possible in which I'll show you how to manually enable this if you don't have it enabled. Other news regarding this this build, we have an improved nearby sharing. Basically, you will be allowed to share files, profile explorer, photos, and so on with computers that are on your private network. And also, you're going to be able to share local files to OneDrive from now on. Also, in this build, we have a new Microsoft Store update with a few improvements. Of course, if you want to see the list of improvements, you can check out the article below in the description. But just go into library and make sure that you click on get updates to have the latest Microsoft Store update because there are some some interesting improvements that will improve the overall user experience altogether. And these are basically the new features and the new changes in this build. Not a lot, but Microsoft is slowly working on improving Windows 11 with new things and new additions. I think that's really nice. Regarding fixes, we have a whole bunch of fixes that were also present in the fixes list from the other build that I've made a video today, which was the better channel build. And in the file explorer, a whole bunch of fixes were applied related to tabs experience, tabs crashes, and the reliability. Of course, we have further improvements to the settings app and also Microsoft fixed a couple issues that could lead to quick settings crashing on launch. Basically, this is all there is to it in this build, not such a big build, but I think this is a little exciting build. For known issues in this build, of course, check out the article below in the description. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. That was Emmanuel from TechBase. Based. Until next time, have a nice day.